Hey guys, welcome to a new video. Behind me is the new G-Class, which I owe you from Paris. Now it was the absolute madness. Now I have a press entry here in Vienna Auto Show. So let's check the new G-Class. I love the new design. I like the new LED lights. This is the AMG package. Kind of looks, to be honest, boring in this white color, but it is what it is. These are tinted, like more dark blinkers, uh, massive wheels new so this is like second generation of the d-class you can see the exhaust on the bottom i like the led lights it's kind of refreshed so let's check the interior now the one in paris was better packed had a better package um, but this is really nice the seats not down as you can see they can tilt uh, premium materials on the top these lights are just for the car show so you can see better inside they are not standard and we'll close this still has a nice closing sound of a jeep car um huge massive alloy wheels i think these might be um i'm not gonna lie here 22 i cannot see let me see yeah 22 inch tires i like the exhaust on the back uh, V8 B Turbo AMG. This is the package. So these guys just went inside. We're supposed to get inside, so we're gonna uh, watch the interior a little bit more. We have 360 parking cameras, uh, diffuser, real air intake. So nice. Okay, so we can get inside now. So that closing sound that you like in the G Class. Um, I like this leather, it looks so premium. You're like in a bus, so on the top, you're there are mirror controls, your windows controls. Now, yeah, piano black finish is kind of lame. You should go with a red carbon fiber, I like that. Um, premium speakers, the best in the car industry. AMG, the seats are nice, they are sculpted. As you can see inside, everything is premium. And let's jump in the up and then I have to jump a little bit um, nice closing sound okay obviously did not close the door properly and beautiful steering wheel AMG I love this one with this piano wood you still have leather here so it's kind of tilted on this I mean um, shrink on the sides there I don't know if you can see here beautiful uh, digital cockpit with lots of functionalities here um, when you turn on the car let me turn on the uh, middle screen of AMG here I'm gonna mute that sound lower the volume all the way um, let it turn on beautiful AC vents you have here driving modes uh, menu for the infotainment this is the huge Entertainment. Of course, you have to sell this manual, <coughs> excuse me, this system with a wheel. Um, lots of features. I'm not going to go into details just to show you one of the menus. Classical Mercedes. And this is it. Armrest. Huge storage area. A little lighting area here. SD cards. Uh, two USB chargers. Cup holders. Uh, wireless key place to place your key you have here presets you have beautiful watch of course you have here for the menu i guess um, car is in some sort of safe mode and of course you have valves so you can open them uh, parking cameras let me see if i can turn them on i guess no the screen is kind of frozen and i believe the car needs to be uh on so low range off suspension you can probably lift the air suspension um driving modes i guess dynamic um yeah okay so not gonna go into details probably never gonna see this in croatia other people are waiting a huge speaker on the top really nice and should wrap it up here uh lights banner roof uh spacious on the back let's check the back and just to show you, have quarters here, really nice, and I like this, this is firm, 
So both sides have electronic operated seats and heating. Let's check the back space. Tinted windows on the back, same premium materials on the back, heated seats as well. Let's jump in. And as expected, a lot of space here for back passengers. AC vents on the back, have digital information, the car is on, five volt charger on the back, a little ashtray, and a USB for charging. Have LED lights on the top, of course, the <coughs> seats get filled. You have an opening here, the coolers. That's pretty much it guys, I don't need to mention this car is super spacious, it's a still a cool car despite its boxy look. Tell me what you think in the comments below, like this video helps me a lot and subscribe to the channel in Vienna Car Show, so subscribe, watch other videos, there's a lot of other cars I'm going to see and stay safe on the road, I'm going to see you in the next video, bye.